and this is Stephanie Manley with copycat.com. Today we are making Chart House Blue Cheese Salad Dressing. This would also go really well with some wings. And you know, it's always fabulous when you can not buy a product at the store and you can make it at home and it tastes even better. So that's exactly what we are going to do today. So to make our own homemade blue cheese dressing, we're gonna need about four ounces of blue cheese. I am using Maytag blue cheese here. It's not just a washer. It's also a type of cheese. I'm gonna use mayonnaise. I'm gonna use sour cream. We're gonna use a little bit of powdered mustard. This adds a nice little spice, it's fabulous stuff. We're gonna use a little bit of garlic. We are also going to use some Worcestershire sauce because that always adds the perfect kick. A little bit of salt and a little bit of pepper. And you know that's all you really need in a salad dressing. It's just those few simple ingredients and it's really easy to do. So in this bowl, I have my mayonnaise and now I'm gonna add my sour cream. And be sure to click on the description bar down below the recipe for the exact measurements. I have a link to my website for that. All right, so we have the sour cream and the mayonnaise together. Now we're gonna have, we're gonna add in the mustard, a little bit of garlic powder because everything goes better with garlic, right? Well, probably not chocolate cake, but many things go better with garlic. Now we're gonna add a couple of dashes of Worcestershire sauce. I'm gonna add some black pepper and a little bit of salt. All right, now we're gonna stir this together. We have a nice, really thick, creamy, salad dressing right here. It's gonna be amazing. All right, so the next thing we need to do is we actually need to go ahead and crumble our blue cheese in here. So just go ahead and carefully crumble that in here. Now with the salad dressing, you need to make this ahead of time because the flavors need to go ahead and marry and mingle together. Okay, so once you get your blue cheese all crumbled up, go ahead and stir it in. And now all we need to do is we need to wait about four or five hours before enjoying the salad dressing. So I'm gonna store it in a mason jar because everything looks and tastes better when it comes out of a mason jar. So there you go, there is the Chart House Blue Cheese Salad Dressing. I hope you enjoyed it. And please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and drop me a comment down below of what recipe you'd like to see next. Thanks for watching.